Okay, this is a very exciting moment in this entire bomb scare Antilia story because there is first visual evidence that India Today has just put out of the Sachin Baze Mansuk Hiren link. And now we've got some more breaking news for you. The white colored Innova that was seen in footage near Antilia on February the 25th was being driven by Sachin Baze himself, remember? There was a Scorpio with explosives and there was a white Innova as well, remember? Now there is footage making it clear that Sachin Vazir was driving that Innova himself. That car passed the Mulund toll post at 3.27 a.m. on the 4th of March and it comes back to Mumbai at 4.03 a.m. after changing its number plates. The vehicle then reaches near Antilia Vaze gets out of the vehicle wearing a long kurta and a hoodie cap. Then he kept the threat letter in the explosives-laden Scorpio. Incredible twists and turns playing out live in this broadcast, ladies and gentlemen. Pay very close attention. I won't let you get misled over the details because India today has its complete control over this information because India today has it first. At 5.18 a.m., the same Innova SUV again crosses the Mulun toll post. So, the man you see in that red circle there, in a big kurta and some kind of a head covering to conceal his identity, is Sachin Vaze. He's the one who apparently keeps a letter in the Scorpio SUV, which already has the gelatin sticks in it. So, the man driving that white Innova, the mystery has been solved, it looks like, was driving that white Innova. Sahil Joshi and Pankaj Upadhyay live with me from Mumbai. Sahil, you know, this is incredible. This is incredible, Sahil, because this is not just exclusive. This may be the biggest, the biggest turning point in this case so far, Sahil. What you and your team have accessed right now provides the first visual evidence of the most central question that has been asked so far in this. The link between Sachin Vaze and Mansuk Hiren has been completely exposed now. Two bits of footage, one of Mansuk Hiren getting into a car with uh, Sachin Vaze at a traffic light. And now we're talking about this white Innova, Sahil. Absolutely. In fact, uh, you know, it, it completely uh, uh, weaves in how the conspiracy was plotted by Sachin Vaze to keep that uh, uh, Scorpio uh, near uh, Antilia. You know, it, it, it's very clear that uh, because he was involved in that, he forgot that the letter should be kept in the car because that is that was part of the original plan, that there should be a letter of threatening uh, to Ambani's and the letter was addressed to Nita Ambani. So, so, so basically, he forgot the letter to be kept inside the car. So he goes back, uh, he, he goes back to Thane, he realizes that the letter has not been kept. Then he comes back in the same car and uh, if I can read out the number plate which uh, can be seen on that particular Innova because he changed the number plate and after changing the number plate, mm. uh, what we can see here is that uh, the, uh, uh, the white color Innova which comes back uh, has a number plate MH10AZ uh, is the number plate which was being used uh, by that particular car. I, I will just read out the exact number of the number plate and uh, you know, the investigating uh, agencies did not only stop at that. They have recovered the footage from Mumbai crime branch as well because Sachin Vaze was using that particular car multiple times and with the same number plate. And that is the reason why they realized that uh, this is the car which was being used by Sachin Vaze yeah. with the same number plate and that's how they nailed it. Uh, so, and uh, this particular number plate was being used by him multiple times. He was using multiple cars. Uh, so, so uh, right now, what they have got is the Volvo car which has been confiscated from Daman. The second car basically is that, uh, that Mercedes car which was confiscated from the Crawford Market parking lot. Uh, the third one is the Innova car, which is uh, which was being used by the crime intelligence unit of the crime branch. And there are two more cars which are being under search, that is Skoda and uh, this particular uh, uh, Audi, which we are talking about. Uh, it was also seen that mm. he, uh, Sachin Vaze was driving that Audi along with uh, Constable Shinde, who was part of the Mansuk Hiren murder, and ATS had arrested uh, Shinde in that particular murder case. From Shinde's uh, home, they have recovered a printer uh, and that particular threat letter was taken out 
uh, uh, using that particular printer. Yeah. So, you know, this is how they have weaved it. It started from 17th of Feb. 17th of Feb, the footage which we are showing on our screens at this point of time, Mansu Kiran parks his Scorpio uh, at Vikroli. Uh, from there, he takes a Ola, he comes to uh, CST station. Hmm. Uh, from there, he walks around two minutes to the GPO signal at Fort where Sachin Waze comes in the another car, he stops at the, uh, at the, uh, at the, at the traffic signal. There, uh, Mansu Khiren sits inside the car, uh, in that uh, particular car, and then they leave from there. The next day, immediately, Mansu Khiren goes to the Vikroli police station, registered a complaint of car theft, and since then, uh, for seven days, it, nothing happens. Then on 24th, suddenly, this particular Scorpio is found outside, uh, near to Antilia, where uh, the 20 gelatin sticks and the letter which Sachin Waze kept inside the Scorpio uh, were found inside the Scorpio. So, you know, this is how Sachin Waze's role in this uh, particular, uh, 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 the, the, in, partic in this particular case was uh, nailed by the investigating agencies. And this is the footage which actually nailed uh, Sachin Waze for the first time. If you remember, yes. uh, the first day when De Devendra Fadnavis raised this issue that Mansu Khiren and Sachin Waze were in constant touch, this is how the investigating agencies had got to know that Sachin Waze is involved in this case. Mm. And on the same day, then Mumbai police transferred that particular case from Sachin Waze to uh, uh, ACP Alak Nure, and that's how Sachin Waze was kept outside the case. So that's what, uh, what the investigating agencies think, that Sachin Waze was not only misleading everybody, he was also misleading his own government. He was briefing wrongly to his own government. Of course, now all that will be part of the NIA investigation now because now both the cases have been transferred to NIA and the investigating agencies suspect uh, that there are some more people involved in Mansu Khiren murder case, okay. uh, which will obviously be linked to Antilia uh, bomb scare case as well. Okay, we're taking a very quick break. Agenda set. Agenda set for the day on the country's biggest crime story right now. The murky Mumbai Antilia bomb scare saga has taken so many twists and turns. There is a big political war being fought, but two pieces of video footage accessed by India Today's Mumbai Bureau have now set the agenda and taken this story to the next level. I can tell you nobody else has it. Only India Today has it at this point of time. We are decoding every frame of this CCTV video footage. We're leaving you with this, but come right back after this break because we're taking the story forward. We've got more footage, more details, and much more breaking news.